AEW Dynamite title Tuesday. We are witnessing a back and forth battle between Hangman Adam Page, Switchblade, Jay White. Jay White claims that he is the true AEW World Champion. That is, in fact, MJF, but Switchblade Jay White in possession with that AEW World Championship title belt, but dangerous territory for both men, Taz. Yeah, big time. It's dangerous up there, especially if you're Hangman Page. You got one wheel, that's issue. You got an issue. And he pull off whatever he's fixing to pull off here. Boy, this, you're talking about high risk, guys. This is the epitome of high risk. Oh, God, this is dangerous. Oh, God. Oh, what? Buster from Hangman Adam Page. But as we've seen, the damage done to the right knee of Hangman Adam Page continuing to plague him throughout this match, Tony. And Excalibur, I think he hit that knee as well when he was on his way. He hit the bat. Let's take a little look at it. Yep, the right wow. knee of Hangman Adam Page. Boom, and he flipped over. I think Hangman tried to put his left leg down, Taz, but that actually inflicted more damage on the right. Absolutely. Your upper body becomes top heavy. You, you're doing a moonsault while the man's across your chest like a, a T flipping through the air. But it's a tough landing on your on your knee. I mean, and you saw what happened here with Hangman, but the worst landing is on Jay White. He's pulled that knee pad down. I, I don't get that. I, well, it's probably because it's swelling up. So he's trying to just let it breathe, you know. Sometimes when you're pain like that, you don't know what to do. Yeah, trying to alleviate pressure at all costs, but Switchblade Jay White trying to alleviate the pressure put on him by Hangman Page with a thumb to the eye. He's doing so successfully, but Hangman, oh, just out of, out of sheer instinct, Tez. I think Hangman put up that right boot. We saw him score with it earlier, but the Orinage connects the cover by Switchblade, and... But Taz, you, you're in a situation where you're injured, you're desperate. You throw up that right leg, not thinking about the damage because it's it's paid dividends for you before in the match. Absolutely, absolutely. You got to go all in. That's exactly right. And now you know. I'm telling you, like Hangman, man, he's he's on the switch about to get beat here. I think switchblade Jay White looking for that half and a half suplex, but Hangman, heavy elbow, rolling elbow, second one. Switchblade drops. Hangman. Uh, let's see if he can do it with that knee. Yeah, I don't know, Shivani. I don't yeah. know if this is smart. I don't know about the butt shot. He's going to try it. Nope. Oh, my God, a dragon screw. The I dragon mean. screw in the ropes does even more damage than the standard one because your upper body is, your, the rest of your body is stopped, and so it allows downward extension on all the ligaments, all the tendons in that leg. And when those ligaments and tendons get damaged like this, the knee will swell up and it feels tight. If you've never had it happen to you, I have. Your whole joint, that knee feels like it's filled with cement. It just gets that tight. Your skin, it, it's the blood, everything just swells up. And now Switchblade may be looking for the Orinage, the Avalanche Orinage off the ropes. Whatever it is, Hangman Adam Page, he senses the danger. And now, Guillotine Switchblade on the turnbuckle. What a counter, what a way to slow down the offense of Jay White. That was great by Hangman. And there you see MJF's world title, I believe, right there on the, on the floor, right at the apron. Well, because the Bullet Club's keeping an eye on it. Yeah, they are. Oh, that's why those three men are keeping an eye on that. And Hangman. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What is this? He's trying to. Ari Hara moonsault. But did you see that little hop Wait. after he landed, Taz? I sure did. But I'll tell you what, he, he, he's got to be hurt, Hangman, but he's going to keep battling. He knows he has some momentum right now. That was wild. That moonsault was nuts. Cowboy's getting ready to beat a thief. Here, oh, boy, Jay. I think Jay Buell was coming. Look at that great. Well, he's going to pull himself up. He's trying to get himself out of bounds, I thought. I thought he was, too. Trying to put some distance between himself, Hangman, and that buckshot lariat. Hangman. Oh, no. Jay White. He was waiting for it. Going to get a German here. Drew Hangman in. The German suplex, and Hangman able to kick out. Jay White hangs out of the waist lock, Taz. Yeah, he does, and he had good lower body on that. He was real low on his grip. Uh-oh. He might be going with that throw. Oh, oh boy. That. Oh. Oh, the chop oh, block. Man. And now, third time he's going for it. Jay White, that sleeper suplex. Jeez. Hangman, though, up to his feet. Oh. That's a heavy clothesline. Boy, was it ever. That's how he throws it. A desperation haymaker by the Hangman. You got to push off with the legs, Taz. I don't know how much of an effect it had. I still don't think it's a good move, Shabani, going for this buck shot. I really don't. Buck, shot, Larry, no! Yes, I knew it! And the Blade Runner attempted, no, hang oh, on! Dead eye! Dead eye! Center of the ring! Oh, here they come, here come the clowns! Bullet Club holder, panicking! Yeah, they are, I was gonna say, 
Dominic Panic gonna cover. Two and no! James White kick it out. And that dead out. Oh, oh, oh. And I, I have to believe it was the momentary distraction by Bullet Club Gold. Had referee Bryce Remsburg counted immediately. That might have been it for Jay White. I think you're looking at Prince Nana with the crown. He's a little bit of receipt, maybe. From earlier tonight. Yeah, Jay, Jay White, though, rolls up Hangman. He's got the trucks. Look at that. He's got the trucks. No. Oh, oh, oh. This match. So it's played. Jay White. He's a thief. He stole the world title from MJF, and he stole that win as well. He, no, he did. not tell you what, man. That was slick. Because I promise you, in my opinion, Swerve Strickland, he sent Nana out here to get that receipt that you called him, Shivani. Yeah, Hangman had a page disarm Swerve Strickland earlier tonight. Our opening contest now, Prince Nana. He wasn't able to connect with the crowd, but it didn't matter. It didn't matter because Switchblade Jay White rolls up Hangman. He grabbed a handful of trucks. He grabbed the belt of Hangman for extra leverage, and he scored the win. And look at Hangman. Hot. He's so pissed off at Nana right now. He can't even run because of the knee. Yeah. yeah. Hangman just limping up the ramp. Nana, probably two towns over by right now. Yeah, that's a good chance. That's Jay White. You saw that AW World title there again. That is not his title. He's just joining in here. Jay White is not the AW World Champion. This guy coming out here is. And the fans are going bananas. You need to be careful, man. They have surrounded. Look at me, Jay White, you son of a bitch! You wanted the main event match, bright lights, full gear for the world title? You got it! You're welcome! Now give me back the Triple B! MJF. Triple B is that world title. And that means more to MJF than just about anything in this world. Well, Max is not going to the ring because he's outnumbered. Be a man! He's not stupid. Okay, okay, hang on. Hang on. I just took it to 4-0 with Hangman. Could you please repeat that, Max? No, 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 no. We don't want to hear any more from MJF. No, no. We want to hear from J-A-Y. Shush! 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 Hey! 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 Your scumbag wants the Triple B! You won the Bang Bang Bang! Well, I was, I was going to say yes until you were so rude, so the answer's no, sorry. Their fault. Their fault. Okay, okay, okay. You know what? I'll be the bigger man here. Jay, Jay, I know you better than you know you because I was you, and frankly, I'm still not that far off, but Lord knows I am trying. You are the guy who doesn't give a damn about anybody else. You will do whatever it takes to get what you want. You will use people, you will abuse people, you will maim people. Matter of fact, those guys standing around you that you claim to care about, deep down, you and I both know you could give less of a shit about any of those three. You are using them to get where you want to be. And I would know, Jay, because that is right out of the MJF playbook. But unlike you, Jay, every day I wake up, I do the hard thing. I wake up and I try to be a better man. And it is hard. I hate it. 
but deep down I know it's working because for the first time in my life when I look in the mirror I ain't punching out the reflection and because for the first time in my life I have earned their respect now Jay White there are two things in this life I care about my brother Adam Cole, who is out right now injured and needs two surgeries, and that's my cross to bear. As if me dealing with your shit isn't enough. And then there is that title you were holding, but you call it a belt. My friend, that ain't a belt. That is my livelihood. That is my legacy. Because when you win the AEW world title, that makes you the best wrestler in the goddamn world. Now, Jay, I hate your guts. Matter of fact, if those schmucks weren't surrounding you, I'd have already broken your legs and your neck and taken back what is mine. Trust me on that. However, However, I do not let that cloud my judgment. Jay White, I know how talented you are. I know you're next level. I know you're elite. And I am sure someday you will join the very exclusive club of being an AEW world champion. However, that day is not today. Do you understand me? So I'm gonna ask you to do the hard thing for what's in your life. I'm gonna ask you to do what I've done. Dig deep, be a man, show some dignity and respect, not to me, but to the sport, to all elite wrestling, and to these fans. And give me back what you have not yet earned. And I haven't earned this, huh? Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You're just coming out here and asking me to give it back to you. How is that earning it? But first off, thank you for coming and asking face to face so nicely instead of jumping me from behind in your cute little devil mask. But you're just asking for this. I don't know if you know how this works. You can't just ask for this. Like you just said, you have to earn it. You have to win it officially in a match, and you have a match coming up November 18th, Los Angeles Kia Forum, full gear. You have that match, so be patient. You'll get your chance where you'll fail. No, I won't. Mm. But, but, Max, 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 if you can't be patient, if you can't wait, like you just said, you could just come on down and take it. But something tells me with us five here, you don't have your gimp squad, there's no Adam Cole, you have no friends, so you ain't coming down. But I tell you what, you find three people that can simply tolerate you, let alone team up with you, you come and put your four up against the Bang Bang Gang. And if you win, maybe you'll get the Bang Bang Belt back. Four Bs. Hey, 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 yeah, and Friedman, before you leave, Friedman, I heard through the grapevine that next week there's a dynamite diamond dozen battle royal, baby, for a chance to win that stupid ring that you care about so much. So throw my name in, because I'm going to win the battle royal. I'm going to whoop your ass. I'm going to take your ring. And we're going to have everything that you love, you idiot. And then guess what? When that's all done, I'm going to give you a little present, something you're really going to like. Oh, yeah. What's that? What's that? I, I already got it wrapped. What is that? What is it? There you go right there. <laughs> I don't know if you can see it. But it's got your name on it, buddy, old boy. Right there, Friedman. $10 worth. You know what I do with these, Sonny Jack? I break in its jaws. So after we ruin your life, 
I'm gonna put a roll of quarters in my hey, hand. Hey, hey, you come near me with those quarters, I'll end your life, you piece of shit! Oh, yeah, with well, Jay Watt, well, I'm sorry, Juice went a little, yeah, I think he went a little too low there. MJF, he's, t he's talked at length about th the bullies that would torment him right. in his youth by, by throwing quarters at him, and right. Juice hey, Robinson touching hey, a nerve right there. Hey, that goes to him, and this goes to you. MJF, and you lot, if you ain't down with that, we got two words for you. Guns up! Yeah! That's brutal. Yeah, that, that, that was a little, that was low. I mean, yeah. because of the history and, uh, like you had mentioned, that's Cal, if you don't know. I mean, in his childhood and school, he was bullied. And he uh, phone quarters at him, meaning Max. And yeah, Juice Robinson knows that all too well. But at Full Gear Saturday, November 18th, it will be MJF, Switchblade, Jay White, the AEW World Championship on the line. But fans, right now, let's take a look.